Hey, Donnie Jones Live. I am Donnie the Tree Lady. And I am that guy, Marty McFly, that is. <laughs> I am just <laughs> flabbergasted right now. I don't even have the words to, to, to say. Right. Um, one of our, uh, our assistants went and got us some coffee. Yeah. And they said it cost $20. Yeah. Okay. Dollars? Literally. $20. $20. $20. That, and yeah. it doesn't come with a refill. No. I'm like, no, because we're not there, right? But. Where has it gone? I, I, I'll, I'll be honest with you. I was wondering today. I got my hair cut, okay? Yeah, and your hair and looks nice, by the way. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. But my, my problem was, my head hasn't got no bigger. <laughs> but the price <laughs> of my haircut gets, it keeps going yeah. up more and yeah. more. And I'm like, wait a minute. Now, I know I, I'm going to sound old, but like when I was coming up, right. you could get a haircut for like $2, maybe $5. Right. I got to college, and you you... You was premium if you got a $10. It was $10, 15, yeah. Right, you know. And I'm older than you. Right, right. Yeah, yeah way older than me. But when 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 I started realizing, no, okay, did. $20, okay, then it was $25. Now it was $50. Yes, to get your to hair get cut. To get my hair cut. Yeah. I, where is... Okay, okay economy, it is yeah. inflation. Okay, it, and, and it's funny because I know we're in a political season, but, you know, obviously we want to be mindful of whatever season we're in. Right. But, but, but thinking about where we're at right now, groceries are higher. Yeah. Okay, services are higher. Right. Um, you go to Home Depot to buy goods for your homes, it's higher. You mm -hmm. know, going out to restaurants is higher. Going to a fast food place is higher. And my thing is this. People are saying that it's, you know, the post-COVID economy and stuff like that. Uh -huh. But I also think there are businesses, some of them big, some of them small, that are trying to make up for what they perceive they lost or in, 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 uh -huh. in reality that they did lose. I and I look at it this way. I had saw a donut place, not that I was eating donuts, <laughs> a donut place, and it had um, a little plaque that said they had to raise the prices, right? What I'm okay with a donut going from like, a dollar fifty two dollars but up to four dollars no that's no. double that's not no. covid no. that's you just increasing the price right same thing you go to waffle house not saying that i went to waffle house went to waffle house the other day uh -huh. and it's like then prices have increased but not only that if you get a to-go order right there's an automatic 20 percent put on and they say the 20 percent goes to the person that prepared the meal and the person that you know, I guess. Get, get but my thing, that's for a to-go order. <laughs> How, it's for a to-go order. Why do I put a tip in for a to-go order? Yeah. You know, if I'm coming in and I'm picking it up, yeah. and I, I don't know what's wrong with the world. I'm saying the only person right now that I can realize, or the only industry that I will say that has not went up on their prices is probably my hookup man. Yeah. You know, my hookup dude. I'm saying every time I go, it's still the same 20 that, you know, you I'm get. I'm going to hurt him. I'm just well, I'm just being him. honest, you know what I'm saying? All the other places, everything him. goes up. Like you said, milk I'm goes up. I'm the price him. of chicken goes up. I'm saying, chicken always been cheap. But exactly. now it's expensive. Now it's cheap. I gotta... But think about eggs. Eggs are more expensive. But my thing is this. That's why I think it's very important that we be mindful of the people that we support. Because you got so many people right now, and I know we'll take up, talk about this a little bit later in detail, but we got people right now saying how much they care about people how much they care about your pocketbook, how much they care about the middle class, how much they care about the poor, but they're the ones that are in charge right now mm -hmm. of an economy that is really hurting people. And so it's like, I'm trying to be nice with this. Some of this stuff is real, but some of it's artificial inflation. You right. know? Oh, 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 definitely it's artificial inflation to a certain degree. And then, but it, it, it's, the sad thing about it is, it, it is a real numbers game. Oh, you know? it is. And it's, it is. it's 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 business, the the call and demand. Yeah. Because if they did drop all the prices, then it would almost be in this recession. Because That's, they were yeah. saying, you know, if if I drop my services or my mm -hmm. prices, I couldn't survive. That's right. Because you, you still have to get goods and services right. in order for your right. life and your business to I go. I still got to yeah. pay my mortgage and light bills and all that kind of right. stuff. So, and then being competitive too. That's right. You know, because right. um, I because I do. I was making a joke about the the barber shop, but mm -hmm. it's not just one barber shop. Yeah, it's one everybody. barber that right. went up. It's all of them. Yeah, you know, it's Absolutely. like that whole industry said, okay, we need to right. bring our prices up. So I can't right. be. Too upset, yeah. But I would want my paychecks to go up too. Yeah. <laughs> you know? But, but you know. that's where the American people are being hurt. So yeah. everything else is going up, but their pay isn't they necessarily pay, right. You know. And then if you got businesses that are hurting, that are starting to tighten the belt, 
then what? So that's just something to think about. And maybe we can come up with some solutions and help save no, the world. No, no. But, uh, no. yeah, I, it's, it's kind of frustrating. Yourself, save maybe your friend, and that's it. What you just said, you got to <laughs> save yourself. Yep. And you've got to do what you need to do to build the life that you love so that you can afford the things that you want for your family and for your business and for your, for yep, your life. Yep. So, yeah, that's all I got.